my name is Johnny, but most people call me stupid. I don't know where I'm going with this video, honestly. Like, there's nothing interesting going on in my life right now. I moved to LA just because, like, I got likes in the TikTok and now I think I'm a famous creator. Like, I think I'm... Uh, sorry. Sorry, I ate chicken nuggets. The chicken nuggets does this to me. I feel like I'm Emma Chamberlain. <laughs> Just because I went viral on TikTok a couple times, but I somehow ended up moving here. I mean, I'm broke and living in LA. So I, I just thought this would be a good video idea. Being broke, living in LA. Isn't that pretty dope, right? I'm not broke, broke. Like, I'm not living under a bridge or like at a homeless shelter. Yeah, um, I'll probably be a big famous YouTuber in about like five years, but right now I'm not. So, oh my God. I don't understand why there's so many dog hairs. I don't know why there's so many dog hairs all over my room. I don't even have a dog. My life is great. Life is going great. How's LA though? Um, honestly, I don't hate it. But the thing about LA is that you shouldn't move here until you're financially stable. But I don't like following rules. If you tell me not to do something, I'm gonna do it, which is why I'm here. But yeah, that's what this video is gonna be. Me showing you what living in LA is like when you are broke. Oh, do you guys like this sweater? Yeah, I know you guys probably don't like it, but since you guys can't respond to me, I'm gonna say you like it. You got it at Forever 21, because you know, they're going bankrupt, so they're broke too. We just love being broke. Okay, bye. Just to show you guys how uncommitted I am with life, the last clip you saw was two weeks ago and I never filmed the rest of the video because I was lazy and yeah, so here's the rest. Yeah, a month later, sort of, sorry, yeah. Finally, I'm gonna start with the vlog of being broke in LA. So I'm excited, I'm ready. So since this vlog is about being broke in LA, I decided I'm gonna go grocery shopping and not Uber there. Exactly, I'm gonna walk there. Like the old boomers used to do, walking. Do you guys know how badly I want Chipotle? But we are broke and broke people do not eat Chipotle, they eat at home with microwavable food and stuff. Did I say that word right? I said it wrong. I'm illiterate. I'm dyslexic. Hi, my name is Johnny. Nice to meet you. Look at that pinks over there. Look at all those people waiting in line to get diabetes. You guys, we made it. We're going grocery shopping. Just kidding. We're not white or rich, so we're going to the 99 cent store. So I have made it to the 99 cent store, and there's a lot of cereal here. A lot to pick from, and I don't know what to pick from, but I think I'm going to go for Frosted Flakes. Frosted Flakes here are $1.99, but I kind of want to check how they are at the White Sprouts Rich store. Maybe they let me in. I think I'm gonna go check it out. Maybe it's cheaper or maybe more expensive. I'm excited to go look. Are you guys ready? Let's go look. Ooh, fancy doors. That was so fancy. You guys saw that it opened by itself. You guys, I cannot find cereal here. I don't know if it's like rich people don't eat cereal. Maybe that's like a broke people meal, but I really want cereal. I came to Target for no reason. I just wanted to come to Target because I feel like Target is like therapy. Um, so it was a fail. I went to 99 cent store. It was like 199. Then I go to the freaking Sprouts, the bougie store for like Beverly Hills people, and it was three dollars. Like what? I don't know who like society thinks we are that we can just like have that much money. It's crazy. Looks like I'm gonna be left without the cereal. Either way, I'm lactose, so maybe it's a sign from God. I don't know what to do now. I'm kind of bored. It's still kind of early. Maybe I should go downtown. Should we go downtown? I think we should. Should we? I don't know. Maybe. Hmm. So yesterday I was hitting this TikTok dance like really hard, like I was feeling and like I was like bah, 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 bah. and like I guess I did it too hard because the back of my head hurts and I feel like my brain's like in there, you know what I mean? My head hurts, that's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> I just heard someone like die. I don't know what this video is anymore. Okay. I'm really contemplating if to go downtown or not. I don't know what to do. Should I do it? Maybe. Now I'm debating if to buy Starbucks. I don't know. I am broke. So should I do it? I don't think I should. Probably not going to do it. You got to save your money, kids. Be smart with your money. You don't need it. You just want it. Sometimes it's not such a bad thing to treat yourself. Don't judge me. Hi, did you forget? Yeah, we're broke today. So we want to go downtown. Me and my... Oh, yep. Doesn't want to be on camera. I forgot. Sorry. Please... 
Are those Harry Potter go in any anyways? Um, we want to go downtown and broke people ride the bus. Wait, no, let me rephrase that. Just because you ride the bus does not mean you're broke. That's not what I meant. But, you know, like some people that can't afford an Uber ride a bus. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to go downtown. I'm just, I'm, I'm, okay. Yeah, we're going downtown on the bus. Okay, bye. We're waiting for the bus. I don't know how this works. Do we order it? What I have concluded from this experience is that the bus is not reliable. People should not ride it because it just shows up if it wants to. Right? Because, like, I've been waiting and it just, I, does it want to come? So, it's not reliable. Don't do it. Don't do it, kids. Uber. All I wanted to do was go downtown to that one place where the Hispanics yell, um, phone case is $5, phone case is $5, where they sell like the fake James Charles palette, like, you know, that street in downtown. But I can't even get there because the bus isn't showing up. I'm so mad. I'm pissed. I'm aggravated. Is that a Tesla? Is that David Dobrik? David! It's coming, 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 it's coming. The bus is here! Woo! We did it! Doctor requested, please use rear exit. For your safety, watch your step when exiting the bus. I memorized that. Got this. <laughs> okay, now I don't know where we're at. Where are, okay, this looks sketchy, oh god. I told you. Oh god, no. We're not in Hollywood anymore. I should probably put my camera down. Yeah. Yeah, probably, yeah, okay. Um, I'll text you guys when we're safe and somewhere that we know that we're not gonna get slaughtered or murdered or bye. Okay, I just ordered an Uber. Um, we're gonna go to the movies instead. I think that's it with being broke. I mean, it's okay to treat yourself every once in a while. But yeah, I don't know. I think this is a wrap for the video because I don't know where we're at. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I hope you keep watching. If not, it's fine. I don't really care. And um, peace. Oh my god, I don't know where I'm at. I need to go home. So I ordered an Uber pool because you know we're broke. But Uber pool makes you walk like three miles to your Uber and then like other people join, sadly. So we're walking around a sketchy freaking up. Oh, almost got run over. Life is great, you guys.